Hey guys, Cheese here, and welcome to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. How's everybody doing today? I'm having a great day today, and we're back here on our Beginners The Island series. And on the last episode, if you caught it, we tamed up this guy, the Chotter. He's super cute. Oh, did you see him blinking us? He's so cute. He's super cute and super adorable, but he's kind of a pain in the butt to keep alive because he only eats fish. So I don't want to be constantly constantly harvesting fish by hand. So on today's episode, I think we're going to go out and tame something to get us fish. Now, we could get a dolphin, although they're pretty terrible. They're pretty weak. Their dolphins are pretty weak creatures, to be honest. We could get a shark. Sharks are pretty good. They definitely harvest lots and lots of meat. But what I thought would be cool and not a lot of people do or use are really cool creatures called Pelagornis. And they're birds. Oh, nice poop, Chotter. Uh, they're birds that can land on the water and they can they get an attack boost against fish. They're also really good at, get, at gathering organic polymer, which is great. And here's the, the clincher of the whole deal is you can fish off the back of them. Now, if you guys haven't heard, on February 5th, which is in five days from now, the uh, Valentine's event starts, and they've hinted that there's going to be a lot of fishing involved to get the new five new chibis that are coming out. So, I figured it'd be great preparation for us for the Valentine's event and all the fishing we're going to do to get the new chibis, and we can feed the chotter. So that's what we're going to do today. So if you guys like this episode, please do me a huge favor and flex on that like button, yeah! And for more daily video game awesomeness, don't forget to subscribe! All right, now we're gonna leave the chatter here just because we're not going anywhere uh, cold. We're not going to get artifacts and I don't want the chatter to die. So we're gonna leave the chatter here where he's nice and safe. You stay here. Uh, you, you stay here. You did. No, I love you more. I love you. Okay. Uh, we're going to leave the chatter here. Now, Pelagornis uh, can be bullied. So we brought some bullies. And they tame off fish meat or prime fish meat or regular kibble. But we have regular kibble. So I have some regular kibble with me and some darts and some bullies. Uh, but I wanted to talk to you guys. Let's see if I can find. I wanted to talk to you guys about harvesting prime fish meat. If perhaps you don't have kibble, you could sail tame these guys up. Uh, we need some saber tooth salmon. You want to get some prime fish meat. You want to find some saber tooth salmon. Those are the big long looking fish. Um, let's see if we can find some here. Okay, here we go. We found some saber tooth salmon. There's a carno right there. Kind of looking at us. Are you going to come fight us, bro? Are you going to come? You want a piece? You want some of this? Huh? Oh, you don't know about the perfect chargey. Your perfect chargey is going to mess you up, pal. Get wrecked. Get absolutely destroyed. Yeah, that's what I thought. We'll take some of that prime meat. Okay. So here's some saber tooth salmon right here. These are what you're going to want to find for prime fish meat. The easiest um, source. Now you chop them with a sword. Cha! Now this seems counterintuitive, but the best thing to harvest them with is your sickle you know the tool you use to get fiber if you harvest these with a sickle you'll get the most prime meat you can get okay we got zero see as you can see it works out perfectly ah we're gonna edit that part out here uh take two so what you do is you sort a saber tooth salmon like i said and then you harvest it with your sickle and you get zero okay wait i'm eh. all right we'll try this uh, Pull out, well, you kill a saber tooth salmon and you harvest it with your sickle. Wait, are we just getting it and it's not showing? What? I don't understand what's happening. We're, I think we're just getting super unlucky. That's supposed to be the best tool for getting you prime fish meat, or unless they've changed this since the last I heard. Come here, man. There's one more over here. We're gonna wipe, we're gonna, we're gonna make the saber tooth salmon extinct just during our process here. What? Oh god, what's that? Okay. Alright, we're okay, we're okay. Everything's gone wrong. Come here. And yeah. And Alright, um Okay, I have no idea what's happening. Either we're getting super unlucky or they changed this, but I I thought that the saber the uh sickle was the best thing for harvesting prime fish meat. I don't understand what's happening. I'm gonna do some research 
and we'll be right back. Okay, we're back. I looked it up on the wiki and the wiki says, yes, indeed, this is supposed to be the best tool for gathering prime fish meat. So I'm a little confused, not gonna lie. We're just getting super unlucky, I guess. There we go, we got some, let's go. <laughs> it does work. All right, so as you can see, um, this is the best tool for gathering prime fish meat. Uh, it doesn't work all the time, but if you harvest up a few fish, eventually you'll get some. Uh, like I said, we're gonna use uh, kibble though, which is, ooh, pretzel. What level are you, man? So uh, we're gonna find some Pelagornis now, and we'll be right back. And we're back, and we found one. This is a really nice one, actually. I like his, he's got a cool green color, and he's a uh, 174. I'm gonna take care of all these stupid seagulls, though, because these seagulls will steal your stuff. It'll be a real bummer if these seagulls take my darts or my kibble. Ooh, 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 he's on the land, he's on the land. So when, what you wanna do is wait until these guys get close to land, and then try to get a bola on him. Oh, I missed. Okay. That would have been a pretty great shot, but. What just happened? What was that noise? I like, did that like land in the water and bola a shark or something? What, what was that? All right. Um, anyway, come on, man. So what you want to do, just like when you're taming a pteranodon with these guys, you want to make sure your gun's ready and re uh, loaded and ready to go. You uh, get the bola on him. And then just hit him with some headshots real quick. We should hopefully be able to knock him out before he has to take off. Let's go. He's out. Let's go. All right. Super good. Let's going to check the area. Make sure nothing bad is coming. There's a Dillo down there. I don't like that. All right. We're going to throw the kibble on this guy. We're going to put the prime meat on there just in case he eats through the kibble. Prime fish. Now, these guys tame off fish meat. So they'll take fish meat, prime fish meat, or regular kibble. But of course, regular kibble being the best, and then prime fish meat being second best, and fish meat, I would only use, uh, you know, if you absolutely have to, you're not gonna get amazing taming effectiveness. Um, we're just gonna hang out and watch this guy now. Make sure everything is safe. And when he tames up, we'll be right back. And it's up, it's up, it's up, it's up. Our new cheechurd. Oh, it just rolls off the lips, the Cheechurd. Come here, Cheechurd. Come here. Dude, I love the colors on this dude. This super green guy. Come here, man. Hey, hey, where are you going? Come back. <laughs> As you can see, they can uh, go on water, which is really cool. Come here. Can you, guy, yeah, like honestly. Oh, there we go, we had it. Can you just get in your, there we go. Are you serious right now? Wait. I just... <laughs> Do we are we gonna have a problem here, Cheechard? Are we gonna have issues? Huh? Huh? All right. Ah, we got the Cheechard in our ball. We're gonna fly home now. Make him up a saddle and take him out. We're gonna gather some fish meat uh, for the chotter and uh, show you guys a little bit about Pelagornis. And we'll be right back. And we're back. Okay, here we are, back at base. We're gonna throw our new Cheechard out over here. Blam! Um, now we need to make a saddle. We're gonna go into our Ingrams. We're gonna look up Pelagornis. Pelagornis level 30. Relatively easy to make. Um, I didn't notice it saying this. I forgot of uh, it. No, it's apparently it's made just in your inventory. All right, we're gonna go into our inventory. Pelagornis, pull, craft. Let's go, we're making it. Um. Oh, you don't... I fought a seagull and it took the... Oh, man. Okay, now we're going to throw the saddle on the Cheechard. Bam! We're going to leave all the rest of our stuff here for, to save weight. There we go. And... We're out of here! Let's go! Now, this guy tamed up with 2,448 health. 594 stam, that's pretty good. Uh, 16 oxygen, food, doesn't matter. 288 weight and 382 melee damage, 136 speed. So, not too bad flyers, but here's where they shine. Let's see, what do they do for damage against a regular creature? We need something that we can whack around here. 
Of course, now there's nothing. There we go. We get a Syntax Spy over here. We'll whack that. Come here! Oh, it's not a Syntax Spy. It's just a Parasaur. Never mind! Disregard! Right, here we go. We hit four. Bam! 61. Super powerful. Most powerful guy of all time. But here's what you can do. You can land on the water, which is pretty cool. Look how fast I am. It's like a little, like, alive uh, sea dew or something. It's like an arc jet ski, kind of. Um, and then you can come over here to a fish and blam! Look, 612! Bam! Super powerful. They get a huge, huge damage boost against fish. And you can just go around and cruise around and harvest all the fish. Super amazing. Um, like I said before, you can also fish off the back of these guys, which is really cool. 208 fish that quick. It's really, really great. And look how quick they are. Like, we're, we're moving, man. <laughs> pretty, pretty neat. Uh, you can fish off the back of these guys, like I said. I think we're going to get into that next episode on how to fish and everything. Oh, we're being attacked. Now, you got to be aware of that because the fish can attack you. So I wouldn't, you can't, like, park this guy on the water and think he's just going to be safe. Like, the fish will attack you in the water. Um, the piranhas will. So pretty great. I love this guy. He's going to be super handy in helping feed the chotter. But that's about all the time we have for today, guys. And on next episode, we're going to do fishing, how to fish, and getting ready for the Valentine's event. But if you guys liked this episode, please do me a huge favor and... Put a like on that like button. Yeah! And for more daily video game awesomeness don't forget to subscribe and if you guys are looking for your own server like the one i use what are you looking at me what's up pelagornis what's up chichard if you're looking for your own server like the one i use make sure and check out my nitrato link down below they have really great servers and really great prices and excellent customer service i recommend them to anybody that needs their own server and if you haven't seen me live on Twitch, I stream live on Twitch every single day. Lots of ARK and Fortnite last night. Uh, lately, I've been playing lots and lots of Escape from Tarkov. It's a really fun game. I'm super addicted. Tonight, we're going to be doing the boss fights on Ragnarok. I have a crazy rainbow castle build I've been doing over there. We've been working on building sideways buildings, which is really neat. And I'm probably going to build a little fishing area to get ready for Valentine's. So you should come see me at twitch.tv slash Royale with Cheese TV. But before we go, we gotta go say goodbye to Murder. Yo, Murder. Hey, Murder, what's up, man? Hey, what's going on, man? Uh, not too much. We went out and tamed a Pelagornis today. They're really great for getting fish meat to feed the chotter. And we're gonna be able to fish off them. We're gonna figure that out next episode. It should be really great. Hmm, that's cool. Hey, what's the opposite of defeat? Um, I don't know. What? The hands? Get it? The hands! <laughs> Defeating the hands! <laughs> oh, murder. These are just getting... They're just getting worse. I'm pretty sure they're getting worse. That's all the time we have. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. Cheese and our brandy new cheechard. Out.